So, I just got a call from my doctor's office. The um, x-ray that I did, they didn't see anything in it, which is good because if they had seen something, in, that means that there was fluid in my lungs, and we obviously don't want that. <laughs> Monkeys. Biscuits. Woo! <laughs> but, um, they've scheduled a CT scan, I believe it's called. Um, I'm not sure if they're doing contrast or not going to do contrast or not. I'll find out when I get there tomorrow, but it's tomorrow. So, so the next time you see me, it'll be when I'm waking up to go to the appointment. Hi, my name is Kat. So, um, if you can hear them, apolog I apologize. I don't really have time to like wait for them to be quiet. My mom's on her way and we're going... Uh, we're going um, to... Where are we going to? We're getting a CT scan today because they need to redo it because my last one didn't work out. And my camera is dying so y'all are probably not going to see too much in this vlog. I'm really out of breath. Basically, I'm just going to go get a scan. They're probably going to use contrast dye to see better. Um, yeah, this this vlog sucks because my, like, my camera is dead, so I'm sorry. Don't hate me. So we just got out of the facility. I am in my wheelchair, which is like honestly like something... I don't explain it. It's just so freeing to be able to not like to be able to move around and not feel like you're gonna faint and fall and collapse. It's just it's the best thing. I, I'm so thankful for this chair. My mom can walk to the car and I can get to the car myself without her worrying about me falling. It's great. Okay, so I'm back home. Um, they had me change, which I brought the gray shirt with me because I knew they were gonna have me change because my um black tank top I was wearing. My hair won't come down for some reason. Um, the black tank, tank top I was wearing has metal in it and they didn't want that to show in the um, CT scan. And I had a CT scan before I went to the hospital for it um, for them to look at my chest for a different reason. Ha! I was having the same pain there but we were looking at other things surrounded with my lungs. Anyway, we're waiting. We're probably not going to know anything till Monday. Next week is when I'm going to go back to see Dr. Cantrell. Um, I don't know if she's going to want to see me, but I'm definitely going to go in. I'm going to make an appointment. But she'll probably want to go over the next game plan of finding out what we're going to do if the CT scan doesn't show anything. And, like, I kind of feel like it's not going to show anything. Um, the x-ray didn't show anything, by the way. I don't know if I told you that or not yet. Um... My camera is a little bit more charged now. I charged it in the car. I have a new tick. Um, I'm saying biscuits. Or biscuit. Um, sometimes there's S, sometimes there's not. I don't know why. I'm, I don't really, I'm not really fond of biscuits. They're fine, but like, why biscuits? I started saying it three days ago and it was like, once. And then today I did it like three times in a row and that makes me know, like, okay, it's gonna stick around. Um... So yeah, I have a new tick. X-rays came back fine, which is a good thing because if they saw something, that means that there was fluid in my lungs and we do not want fluid in my lungs, um, obviously. <sighs> Goodness. But um, yeah, I've had a few more like crying spells, but um, because of this and I've been super stressed, tends to all the breakouts on my face, but um, I think I'm doing good considering everything that's going on right now. Um, it's kind of, it kind of feels like one thing after another. I realized that it's my, um, yes, my chest is hurting, but it's my rib cage. Now my f camera's dying again. It's my rib cage that's hurting, especially like here. I don't know if you can see my bone. Right there is very sensitive. Um, and right here, you can kind of see my bone a little bit. But, yeah, it's hurting right there a lot, and then up in my chest up here, but not in the middle. It's, like, on the sides of, I guess, my boobs, but it's not my boobs. It's, like, deeper in there. Sharp, 
pain when I breathe in, which was really shitty because during the during the um, CT scan, I had to hold my breath. I had to breathe in really deep. Um, I've been noticeably out of breath to the point where you can like hear me breathing, and I've been like staying in my bed. Normally, I'll sit in my chair. It's a huge, huge waiting game, and it's like, bleh. and I don't want to have to wait anymore. I just want some answers, but. The reality is, like, the CT scan might not show anything. Um, and if it doesn't show anything, then it's probably the... It's probably conjunctivitis. I don't really know if I'm pronouncing that right or not. No, conjunctivitis is, I think, pink eye. I keep getting those two, like, fucked up. I'm not saying it right, I don't think. It's not pink eye, it's, um, rib cage inflammation. But we don't know yet. We're just waiting. Um... The one that I, the word I just said that I'm pronouncing wrong, um, there's no test for that. You know, they just press on you and they're like, okay, it's this, because it's, yeah. But, um, she wants to rule out some other stuff because this, the one with the P, ignore the fire whateverness, um, that, I think that can cause, like, your lungs to collapse eventually and so she's got to like rule that out because arthritis can cause that too so yeah um, I'm gonna go to sleep now I'm ex or at least I'm gonna try to go to sleep um, I've been watching I've been rewatching Dexter and so that has been keeping me preoccupied um, Netflix is a big thing when I'm kind of like bed bound which I've basically been for the past two weeks but just hanging in there waiting for some answers i hope y'all are doing well um let me know how y'all are doing but um again i'm actually gonna go this time because my camera keeps blinking at me to charge it so um yeah i'll update y'all soon bye i can't believe i forgot to say it as always thanks for staying alive i love you have a nice night bye